He should have moved over a little more that way. Huh? He should have moved over a little bit further that way. So I'm re, re updating the web page. And we have lots of traffic, lots of Europeans, some people from the US. Um, a lot of people going straight to from Google because you can tell where they come from. But we only have three followers. Myself, my wife, and my eldest brother, Ed. I'm your three older, followers. I'm your older brother. So we have three followers. Lots of people viewing it, but three followers. I asked Siri to subscribe me, and she said, I don't understand what you mean, Andy. Three followers. You don't even follow this channel. Go ahead, cry. <laughs> you deserve to cry. You deserve to cry. Of course, our camera person doesn't even follow. He doesn't even watch our videos. <laughs> Now I'm going to start over. So I was updating the web page. We already got that on tape. Here you have to do your intro. Cheers! Welcome, welcome everybody. What's wrong with you? Pull the muscle in my back and it hurts. Can't turn my head some muscle relaxants. That's why I'm here. <laughs> You haven't taken muscle relaxing, have you? No. Okay. Are you sure? I'll just take that. No, I need that. How are you besides your neck? Well, I just opposed to that, and the allergies have been bad other than that. It's like another day. See, their allergies are raining with him. Another day in paradise. I'm living the dream, baby. Cody's dog is down there trying to figure out how to get to him. Well, the cats have stopped becoming afraid of her, and I'm scared for her safety now. All right, so today we are back with a whiskey. Um, we're looking at Bully Boy Distilleries, the American um, straight whiskey. This is a Boston blend that I got in Boston. It's pretty good. I like it. It's got a nice color, a nice flavor, a nice aroma, everything. So I have some uh, hopes that you and I will be able to uh, appreciate this for our viewers. Have you had this yet? I think I might have tried it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it's $34.99, $34.99. You can get this at Total Wines and More here in Texas, so I'm sure you can get it just about anywhere. Um, $34.99 is gonna be a two barrel, two barrel. So now let's look at our aroma. So aroma comes in uh, very sharp alcohol is a one, pungent is a two, mild is a three, light four, and pleasant is a five. Oh, now I'm torn. It smells really good, but I'm getting a wisp of alcohol. Yeah, that's nice. It <coughs> doesn't smell bad, but it does smell kind of like... It's almost on um, the light side. But then you have the pungence of the... Yeah. So it's going to end up being a three. Yeah, I'm going with a three. That's disappointing. It smells good, but... Yeah, it does got that. <clears throat> that smell really good. <clears throat> what say you, boy? He's, like, I'm he's over there with his headphones trying to figure out sound. Because we not... never did a sound check before this video. At least he's not eating Twinkies. True that. I just made him a whole bunch of pancakes. Don't say anything because his headphones will rip the camera. <laughs> so you're saying a three? <laughs> Two and a half. Like I don't smell much because it's alcohol. Goes off my nose. What a noob. What? Well, he's okay. just got it in a little saucer and he's sticking his whole nose in it. It's... 
It's, nice. it's got a really nice flavor, or uh, aroma to it. Some decent legs, a really nice color though. I don't know if you can tell that color. He's messing with the camera, so if this episode has some sound, video, quality, anything, problems with it, hashtag blame Cody. Just Let's keep yeah. Alright, so uh, flavor. One, very alcohol, bitter but palpable is a two, moderate is three, pleasant is a four, and five is rich. Ready? I already tried mine. <laughs> mm. What is the proof on this? We never did that say. It's kind of complex. It's it, a 84 proof, so it's not that bad. But it does got a pretty... It's got a bite. Right on your... Front of your tongue, it's like... Yeah, you can... It's going to be a three for me. Just a moderate flavor. Yeah. Three. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna give it an and a half. I'm gonna have to come up with a whole barrel rating for Cody. Shmeh. I mean, it's not that bad. <laughs> I'm giving it a three. A three? Okay. I'm gonna give it a uh uh. See, it's at least a uh or a meh meh. So now our problem is, I think all of us are saying it's a three moderate because of that alcohol bite. So it almost means that the biteness factor is going to be sharp. Yeah, I was going to say two and a half. I wasn't going to go a full two. But it is pretty, pretty sharp. I think. Yeah, it doesn't really matter right now. Two and a half. Two and a half. So that puts Andy at 11, Cody at a 10.5, and I'm going to say it's a two and a half as well, which gives me an 11. So that's really a 2.75, possibly a three. If we take in consideration Cody's 10.5, it would drop it to two and a half. Two and a half. But if we throw Cody's out, we could push it to three. Anybody want to bonus it? No. All right. So Bully Boy is going to be a 2.5 on the five barrel scale. It's not bad. No. Um, I would definitely think that a... Uh, a drop of ice That's or what I a couple was thinking. drops of water would uh, make it a little timid and a little bit more pleasing. I think if you the drink this with some ice, I'd give it a good solid three barrel. Yeah. And at $34.99, 35 bucks, I don't know that I would want to go as far as adding Coke to it. And of course, that is my personal preference. I don't really do mixers, but if this was a $25 bottle, then I would say maybe let's add some Coke. Use it as a mixer. Use but it as a, a mixer. Yeah, $35. Do you just dissolve the Coke in there? Sure. <laughs> Hashtag Cody say just no to drugs. I don't know. This <laughs> Being the cost, if it was a 25 instead of 35, I would probably buy it, no problem. Oh, I'd probably still buy it. Being 35, I'm like, eh. I like it. I'd probably order it in a bar and stuff. Um, but depends on what else is in there, in the bar. Yeah. I I've been to plenty of bars where they have a very limited amount, and if I was in Boston and they didn't have any local flavors except for Bully Boy, I'd go to Bully Boy because I'm all about tasting the local. Local flavor, yeah, I agree with that. I would choose Bully Boy over anything from Kentucky or Tennessee if it's in a unique location like that. But if they have a full bar of stuff and a bunch of 
different things from all over and I wasn't in Boston, so I was in California, I probably wouldn't order the Bully Boy because it's not a local from California. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, not too bad though. And I'd say that I just had buy one and have it on. I don't know if I'd buy it again. Just to the fact that we're buying so much other different stuff that it's like, it doesn't, like some of these, I would definitely buy again because I liked it so much. Mm -hmm. I'd want, this one is like, it's good, but there's so much other stuff we're going to try and stuff that I, it's like, it's for me, it's, I don't gotta have it on the bar. Yeah. You wouldn't sacrifice it for something new. Right. Yeah. All and, right, so make sure you hit the like and subscribe. Check out the merch. Neck really hurts, buddy. Yeah. And try the Twitter. Try the Twitter or subscribe to Twitter? <laughs> try to subscribe to Twitter. <laughs> it's follow. Follow, I know. He said try. Smash that button. You said subscribe. Okay, sorry. Smash that like hey. button. Um, follow us on our bourbonandbooze.com. Remember, there's no bad whiskey. There's only good whiskey and great whiskey. It's pretty good whiskey. Pretty good. So cheers. Right. Cheers. Aw. The little guy's neck hurts. Yeah, it does. <laughs> plus, I got a chapped lip, too, so that might be why the barrel rating so low on this. Because of your chapped lip? Burns. Oh, it's gonna say my toe hurts, but it's not kind of made it right the barrel. Did you hurt. pour it on your toe? <laughs> no. Bye. Later. All right. That's a wrap. That is a wrap. All right.